Bij een volleybal is prayer, eh, volleybal is wel een fischer, elder in Mochland Parish Kerk. En hij was de elder die het ziek houdt, every misdemeanor, eh, around the parishioners, and report back to William Old, or Daddy Old, the minister. But the poem developed eh, out of a wee altercation between Mochland Kirk Station and Garvin Hamilton or we should call him Gone Hamilton, as he's called in the poem. So Hamilton was accused of not paying his proper stent to the kirk. And another problem he had was horror of horrors. He was accused of causing or permitting his servants to pick vegetables from his garden on the Sabbath day. So you'll hear a wee mention in the poem of kale and potatoes. And then Robert Taken makes an appearance in the poem. He was a lawyer in air, and he was the man who fought the case for Hamilton against Mochlin Kirk Session in the Presbytery of Air. In horror of horror for the session, they found in favour of Gavin Hamilton. So here Willie Fisher at his devotions. O thou who in the heavens does dwell, was it pleases best thy cell sends yin to heaven and ten to hell and all for thy glory and no for only get her ill of them afore thee i bless and praise thy matchless might when thousands thou hast left in nicht that i am here before thy sight for gifts and grace a burning and a shining light to all this place yet what was i in my generation that I should get sick exhortation. I would deserve such just damnation for broken laws, sax thousand years ere my creation through Adam's cause. When frame my mother's womb I fell, the mickey plunge at me in hell to gnash my gums and weep and wail in burning lake, where damned and devils rear and yell, chained to their stake. Yet I am here, a chosen sample, to show thy grace is great and ample. I am here a pillar of thy temple, strong as a rock, a guide, a buckler, and example to all thy flock. O Lord, thou kens what zeal I bear, when drinkers drink and swearers swear, we singing here and dancing there with great and small, that I am keeping by thy fear, free from them all. But yet, O Lord, confess I must, Sometimes I'm fast with fleshly lust, and sometimes true and worldly trust, vile self gets in. But thou remembers we are dust, defiled with sin. O oh Lord, ye stream, thou kens we make. Thy pardon I sincerely beg. O oh, may it ne'er be a living plague to my dishonour, and I'll ne'er lift a lowly slag again a boner. Besides, a further man a loo, will ease his lass three times a true, but God, that Friday I was foo when I come near her, or else thou kens thy servant true would never steer her. Perhaps thou lets this fleshly thorn buffet thy servant in and mourn, else ye or I in brooch it done that he say gifted. If say thy hate hand man in be born until thou lift it. Lord, bless thy chosen in this place, for here thou hast a chosen race, but God can found their stubborn face and blast their name, who bring thy elders to disgrace and open shame. Lord, mine gone Hamilton's deserts. He drinks, he swears, and plays at carts, and us the money tack and hurts we great and small. For God's ain priest, the people's hurts he steals a wall. And when we chasten them, therefore, you can who he bred sick a spore and set the world in a roar a laughing at us. Curse thou his basket and his store, kale and potatoes. Lord, hear my earnest cry and prayer against that presbytery where thy strong right hand, Lord, make it bear upon their heads. Lord, visit them and then a spare for their misdeeds. Oh, That glib-tongued aching, 
my vera hurt and flesh are quaking, who we stood sweet and shaken and pissed with dread, while old we hanging lip and snaking held up his head. Lord, in thy day of vengeance, try him. Lord, visit them who did employ them, and pass not in thy mercy by them, nor hear their prayer, but for thy people's sake, destroy them in dinner spare. But God, remember me and mine with mercies temporal and divine, that I for grace and gear may shine excelled by name, and all the glory shall be thine.